Good morning to everyone and welcome to another update on the market. For today, I decided to cover US dollar versus Mexican peso. I will speak about the gold market, crude oil and Bitcoin versus US dollar. I will start with the US dollar versus Mexican peso first. So what we have here on the daily time frame is that this uh, currency pair actually is traded in the last couple of months in a downside cycle and most recently in the last 20 days we have this uh, downside channeling mode which is uh, which we we then uh, we got a breakout we had a breakout last week when this day closed upside so this is an initial breakout day and we can see that market is now uh doing the consolidation and uh I will say as long as this low can hold at uh, 16, I will say 70 mark, there is a chance for the higher prices. And ideally, if the market can um, uh, trade and take this, I will say 17, uh, 20, and even if it fully takes 70, 25, there is a chance for the higher prices. And maybe even for the retest of the swing low at 17, 40 mark. So, uh, potential for the upside movement. Uh, maybe if we can see the some lack of supply or something on the way down, there is potential for this rally into the at least the swing low, which is a previous swing low, and um, maybe even further towards the 1760, 1750, 1775 mark. Uh, speaking of the gold market, we can see that market took this pin bar and tail and traded lower, as like we uh, basically. I spoke about on our previous sessions uh, but we can see that uh, also uh, on Friday market traded like had an outside uh, market had a lower low and higher high so it's kind of you know and now its market is in the in the tail in this pin bar and that's already a sign that we increased the the volatility especially on Friday we can see the volatility increased so we set this range 1937 70 mark uh, so that's the swing high and swing low at 1910 mark so i would like to see how the market will behave and if the market can really trade above 19 let's say 38 and hold above there is a chance for you know higher prices towards 1956 but if the market can you know still trade lower and take the 1910 and continue with this downside breakout that we started last week then there is a chance for the price and even the retest of uh, 1885 or even uh, area around 1860 mark. So pay attention on this range because uh, we might see some meaningful uh, price action and directional move if we can break and hold above this level or below this level. Now speaking of the crude oil, we can see that uh, market is still in this very defined range and this pin bar is still there so we have 6360 like a low of this pin bar and the whole territory between 6775 and 6360 is like a whole uh, like a whole area of this pin bar and you can see also on friday market again tried third time and rejected back but overall this is just a consolidation one gigantic consolidation that it's, it's already happening for 30 or 30 or more days so again i would like to see anything meaningful to the downside if we can really clear this pin bar low below 63.50 the, this can open the door for the lower prices and maybe to 60 62 mark even 57.50 might be in a play uh, from other side if we can take the resistance area at 74.50 then this can open the door for higher prices 76 70 level or even 79 mark now speaking of the bitcoin uh, this is the key level to pay attention to last couple of days market didn't have a power to actually break and hold above this level and uh, now basically we have this range this bar here def defined this range and the pivots for now from my perspective i will say uh, 29,556 and we have the high at 31,477 so this is the range that now we have 
we have this, this defined range. And I want to see how the market will play around. So if we can trade below 29,500, this can open the door for lower prices towards the 28,500. If we can trade above 31,500 and hold above, then this can open the door for even 34 area, 34,000 area to be on the test. So that will be all for this update, guys. I hope that you did enjoy. Trade safe as always and speak to you from tomorrow morning.